This is the future. A while ago, someone messaged me via Discord asking if a Souls games are in the works for digital extremes. At first, I was like, what? What are you saying? There's nothing like that and Digital Extremes mentioned anything about a Souls game in coming out in the future. Is this person just trolling me since I both like Warframe and the Dark Souls series, and it might be fun just to mash them up and get my hyped up for nothing? Eventually, it's true, and it's listed in the Reddit leaks, that last week, Digital Extremes applied for a trademark in Europe for Soulframe. You can check the trademark page at the European Union Intellectual Property Office for yourself. Just go check the link I have pinned in the comment section below. Now, we don't know what our digital extremes doing but, it's one thing for sure that this soul frame thing that they registered as a game, and they might reveal it sooner or later. Well, I'm really hype now on what they will actually reveal during Tenecon 2022. Now, the listing in the EU IPO shouldn't be taken lightly. As looking at the previous record of Digital Extremes, all of the listing they have are released games, and some are those cancelled ones like The Amazing Eternals. It's really a big mystery right now what is this registered IP, and if it's a game, it's even mysterious since I just don't know how to merge Dark Souls in Warframe, all I can think of are just fashion frames of Dark Souls, and I never have imagined the possibility of even having a Dark Soul game with Warframes. The closest I can think of is a game like Tiny Tina's Wonderland, or any Borderland themed series wherein it's still the looter shooter will love about Warframe, but now fixed in a dungeon like battle system. We have seen that this works during the new war, where we got to control a Grenier, Corpus, and even Teshin, and the flow of the battle and overall gameplay was smooth as butter. What if, Digital Extremes were already previewing of the things to come during the new war update? What if? Instead of the new PvP system that we are hoping for, they will apply that gameplay to their new upcoming spin-off of Warframe. Right now, these are just pure speculations and I just hope that you share this video so we can get an answer from the developers themselves. Also, take everything that I have said here with a grain of salt, since Soulframe is not even a 100% guarantee that it's a Dark Soul game themed in Warframe, what if it's just a name for an upcoming spin-off of Warframe? I really don't know right now, and I hope to have some answers about this. It sure hyped me up, and it can be possible, but for now, I would really love to know what Digital Extremes would say about this. So please, share the video. Thank you so much for watching. Squad Leader signing off.